Hey everybody, Patrick with Triptic Canine, and of course, Twix. I hope you're all having a wonderful day. Today's episode 52 of Triptic Canine's Tuesday Training Tips. And today we're talking about which dog? We all know we're going to get more dogs. So the question always comes up, which dog should we get? Well, I'm here to tell you that you should get the dog that suits your lifestyle and your capabilities. There are many breeds that come into popularity over the years for whatever reason. Movies, books, TV shows, whatever reason, they come into popularity. A lot of people want them because they see an individual of that breed that looks cool, that's extremely highly trained, um, well-bred, has great genetics, and is highly skilled. Such as the Belgian Malinois. But people get an individual of that breed without, reali without realizing the time, effort, training, and all the other demands that went into creating that dog, that one individual dog, to what it was. So get the dog that fits your current lifestyle and your current capabilities. Do not get a dog thinking, oh, when I get it, then I'll change my lifestyle. Then I'll learn how to do things more. Then, then, then. Don't wait. If you want a dog that you can do more things with, start doing more things beforehand. If you want more, you need to become more beforehand. And that's really it. Because people get the dogs before they change themselves. And it ends up that, that, that the dog is too much for them. Requires too much change. Requires more, much more capabilities than they thought were necessary to have an individual of that breed. And they end up surrendering them. It happens more often than you'd like to think. So to prevent all that, get a dog that perfectly suits or extremely closely suits your current lifestyle and your current capabilities. That's really it. I hope you all have a wonderful day. Get out there, train your dogs, and have some fun because training never ends.